Stop and the fighting to start. This should be good. I'm Todd Grisham, and here with me, my broadcast colleague, it's Johnny Nelson. I feel like a fraud. How have I got these ringside seats? It's time for our tale of the tape. So here is Saul Canelo Alvarez. He's 172 centimeters tall with a reach of 179. And facing him, Sugar Ray Robinson, 5 foot 11 inches tall, weighed in at 147 pounds. He's got a reach of just over 72 inches. Todd, this is well anticipated. I'm so looking forward to this tear up. These two are really up for it. So here is Saul Canelo Alvarez, the Mexican legend, the middleweight, the super middleweight, the light heavyweight who fights out of Guadalajara. Sugar Ray Robinson. Many consider him to... This bout is scheduled for eight rounds of boxing. In the red corner, from Guadalajara, Jalisco, Mexico, here is Mexico's first ever undisputed world champion and renowned star of boxing. Here is a four-division world champion and an... These two have certainly talked the talk. Now they've got a... There's the bell to start the round. They're both going for the KO. It's so obvious. This one has all of those big fight feels you want from a prize fight. Here we go. You have certain fighters that are born for this, that are made for the big crowd. And looking at corner right there, that is that fighter right there. They're elevated, lifted, and flipped up to the big round. This is what they were born for. A perfect counter shot. I don't think it's going to be a boxing match. This is going to be a fight. Big shots from both these fighters. Got to be careful, though. Okay. The hook. Skill for skill. Tap for tap. A match made in heaven. You've got to get in there to punch your opponent before he gets his fist back to block. They have got great ring IQ. Robinson got bumped there. He's in trouble. Go to the canvas. Talk about Robinson in that last round. So it's plan B time after being knocked down in that round. To make or break a fighter. And we're hoping for an all-action slugfest. Quick and finish him off in the last round. Let's see what this has in store for us. What a knockdown. One minute, you need one hour to get over a shot like that. Now it's down to conditioning. Now it's down to manipulation. It's how you are going to deal with this. These punches coming from every angle. I'm going to miss with that hook. This counter puncher is going to wait for you to move first and then will strike like a snake. Keep an eye on this guy. You're going to the counter puncher, you've got a dummy shot. Make them react to that. Then react then. I know it's hard to think that way, but counter punchers, they're watching you. Watching you every move. Halfway through the round, and it's pretty much even. Ray Robinson just got rocked. 
And it appears the onslaught is over, at least for now. Now they've got to wake up. They've got to get on the back foot, clear the head a little bit, then jump back into it. <coughs> Just one punch away from turning his fortunes around. What a crush sleeping on the job. What do you do? You step back, steady yourself, recompose yourself, then boom, back into it. But do not make those mistakes. This is the right place to fall asleep. The winner of this surely will get a world title. This round's still up for grabs with just 10 seconds to go. Punch right up the middle. Let's talk about Alvarez in that last round. I promise you, all three judges here are going to give that round to you know who. I seriously hope the judges kept their eye on this fight because if they haven't, there's going to be absolute uproar. They ring the bell, and here we go. This fight has been very one-sided. What are we going to have in this round? Todd, my motto is, keep broken, keep changing. An excellent last round. Everything works. Wait for the reaction. Until then, keep doing what you've just been doing, because you've won that hands down. <laughs> You hit me hard, I'll hit you hard type of fight. That's really a miss with that hook. Both men step back for just a moment. That hook doesn't score. Skill for skill, tap for tap. Now this fight will say, you know what, we're just that notch of your feet. And so I've got to respect both of them more than people. Well, Johnny, we're in the early stages here. What if you this could be really intimidating, Todd. If you know someone's got the punch power, someone's got the speed, it can be intimidating. It just depends on how confident you are. We've never seen Canelo in this sort of level. Talk about Alvarez in that last one. We're hoping for an all-action slugfest. They really got banged up last round. What can they do here to change the momentum? If I knock somebody down like that, that round, you So this was an unexpected turn of events. What happens next? Trigger Ray Robinson just got rocked. <laughs> it appears they weathered the storm. How? I'm not sure. What recovery skills are you? Try to buy time. It appears that the moment of trouble has passed, at least for now. Defense, defense is everything. Because Robinson hit hard, and he may be ready to go. Didn't wait long to get back in and get it. Sugar Ray Robinson just got rocked.
So it's onward and upward after a knockout win here. A knockout victory? That is... Todd, did you see the shot?